can't believe how obsessed those people were with that Fred guy. So weird, right? I mean, were they really that different from you with Jesse? I, what? No, it, I, I am a stone cold professional. My interest in Jesse was completely professional. Don't be so sensitive, Radar. Petra's just teasing you. I know, I know. Just a little too real. Sorry, Radar. I, I just tease because I love. To tease. So, uh, what's the compass saying? We still heading the right way? Hang on, let me check. Seems like we're still on... Cracks out, everybody brace yourselves! Ow! Ugh. Ugh. Uh, rough ride! Man, the track is a complete wreck. Yeah! What's up with- One person I know fights like that. You are the real Jesse! Ivor? <clears throat> yes! It is I, your friend Ivor. I'm gonna need you now, Jesse! What? Yeah, what? It all started when I fell through a portal into some sort of strange world. Everything was all white, Master Shack. Nice! <laughs> You see? Ninja reflexes. Wait, you tried to hit me. Why'd you try to hit me? That would have been quite painful. Wow. Master Shadow teach you how to whine, too? It seemed like the only way to get you to stop talking. Ah, uh, yes. I'm so sorry. It's just so exciting to see you. And there's so much to say! How about you start with... What the heck you're doing down here? Right! Let me explain. You see, it all started when Harper and I returned from our vacation. We discovered that while we were gone, you had mysteriously vanished after fighting a prismarine giant named the Admin. Right. Only to return, having defeated this Admin and taken his amazing powers. Wait, what? Yeah, that's not right. I mean, you didn't believe it, right? I did it first. How could I not? Looked like you, sounded like you, except now you could fly around and had all sorts of cool superpowers. Jesse, aka the admin, gave me this and told me he had reprogrammed it to find the fraud, aka you. But with my new ninja senses, <clears throat> I could tell something wasn't right. Anyone who disagrees, anyone who questions Jesse, disappears. Oh, they must hate me. It's certainly not helping your reputation. No, but I knew that Jesse, the real Jesse, would never act like that. That's why I decided to try and use this opportunity to discover the truth. Luckily, it worked out because I would have felt terrible about killing you. Classic thing to say to your friends. I can tell you're being sarcastic, but you'd be surprised. Wait, 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 wait. If you weren't convinced, you would have killed me? The admins turned everything upside down, Jesse. It's very confusing up there. Speaking of whom, I can't spend much more time down here. 
If I don't get back to the prison soon and report in, the admin will know that something isn't right. That's perfect. You can make up a lie and you'll never suspect that I'm actually down Which here. will buy you the time you need to find Fred's weapon! Hold on! How'd you know about I'm that? I'm a ninja! Anyway, that plan is all well and good. But what exactly should I tell the admin? It needs to be plausible, but dramatic. Yeah, believable, but entertaining. Realistic, but shocking. Within the realm of possibility, but against all odds. Tell him I died trying to flee the Sunshine Institute. Fluff up his ego. Let him think that he built an inescapable prison. Ah, oh, yes. A fed ego is a happy ego after all. I'm sorry I can't stay longer, but I must go. Go. We'll see you when we get back to the surface. No, oh, wait, can I borrow that amulet? Certainly, but why? Long story involving a portal and a magic frame, but it'll help us get home. Please hurry. It's getting dire up there. Smoke bomb! <laughs> ah! You saw nothing. We all just saw that. Right? I, I didn't, like, hallucinate Ninja Ivor? Nuh-uh. Just when I thought that crusty dude couldn't get any weirder. And we're ready to roll. Come on, guys. 